everyone, it is Hannah, your Sparkling Spectrumite, and I finally have another finish. So yes, I completed Alice in Snow White by Jasmine Beckett Griffith, and this is a craftably kit, and this was, oh my goodness, guys, I wanted to do a post review on this because this was such a fun kit to work on. It was just, it was awesome. I absolutely loved this kit. So a little bit about it. It was 24 by 32 inches. So this was definitely the largest canvas I've completed, but it was worth it, completely worth it. This one was a round drill and it had 51 colors. Now the fun thing, because Craftably does not skimp on you, this kit out of the 51 colors, it had two AB drills, but then it also had a crystal drill, like a rhinestone. And I just absolutely loved, loved doing this kit. It was so much fun. I love the colors. I just love how it's whimsical, but it's kind of dark, like a dark fairy tale. And yeah, there, there is nothing about this kit that I don't like. So just a little bit about it. And as you can see, Money Penny likes the kit too. Um, really with this kit, there were no trash drills. There was nothing of that sort. Uh, I really don't remember many trash drills at all. Maybe there's a couple, but I had plenty, plenty of drills to spare. So I didn't have to worry about that. Uh, the surface, this is a poured glue canvas. So the entire surface remained sticky and what was awesome is that I actually had started this kit back in July and then I rolled it up and had put it away for a little bit and then I got it back out in September. So not only that, I mean, it maintained its stickiness and everything even after being rolled up, put away for a little bit and then brought back out again. So again, just a fabulous kit to work on. It was so, so much fun. So really, there, there is nothing that I can think of negative about this kit. Craftably, Craftably goes above and beyond. I absolutely love Craftably. I love everything about their canvases. They have such amazing products. Um, there really isn't anything that I can say about this. I think the only thing is, if you look at Alice's arm right here, where you know she's holding the sign that says, Eat Me, I remember as I was completing it, there like it was a really dark color and it almost looks like green. You're like, wait, why is her arm green? Like it, it did kind of scare me for a moment, but again, no worries. Cause as you can see, it completely makes the shadow look right. It's kind of, you know, the shadow of the underside of her arm and it looks great. So you just have to trust the process as well. So yeah, this was a wonderful, wonderful kit and I will do a couple of close-up views so you can see it even better and then I'll just have my final thoughts on it. All right, guys, that is all of Alice in Snow White. So again, this was a round drill kit. It was 24 by 32 inches. It had 51 colors, two ABs, one rhinestone, and it was just a joy to work on. The artist is Jasmine Beckett Griffith, and this is sold by Craftably. So 
If you want to do this one, I definitely encourage you to do it. It is so much fun. It is such a beautiful piece. I absolutely loved it. You can definitely go check out Craftably's website. Um, at the time of this filming, I believe it was still in stock. Or if you want, I know Randy over at You Can Call Me Butter had the same painting in her D, in her, uh, D stash video. So I will make sure to link her D stash video down below as well if you want to check it out because I believe she was selling it as well. So anyways, that is it. That is my final thoughts and review on Alice in Snow White by Craftably. It was such a fun kit. I absolutely loved it. I hope this video brought a little bit of joy to your day as it always brings joy to mind making them. And I will see you guys the next time. Bye.